Hi everyone, today I'll be looking at tritone substitutions. As its name suggests, a tritone substitution involves a chord, typically a dominant seventh chord, being substituted by another dominant seventh chord at the interval of a tritone. Before I discuss tritone substitutions further, let's establish what a tritone is. A tritone is any interval consisting of three tones, or three major second intervals. If we begin with a C note, for example, and move up three tones, we reach the note F sharp. C to F sharp, therefore, is a tritone. You may also recognize the tritone as an augmented fourth. C to F is a perfect fourth, and if we raise the F to F sharp, we create an augmented fourth. Enharmonically, the F sharp is also a G flat. Although the interval C to G flat sounds like an augmented fourth or tritone, it is a diminished fifth. Theoretically, diminished fifths are not tritones, as they consist of two tones and two semitones, and not three tones. When discussing tritone substitutions in jazz theory, however, the term tritone is typically used for both an augmented fourth and a diminished fifth, and is the label I'll be using throughout this video. As I mentioned earlier, tritone substitutions typically involve a dominant seventh chord being substituted by another dominant seventh. If we take this 2-5-1 progression in C, for example, a tritone interval above the root of the G7th chord is C-sharp, or D-flat. Our substitute dominant, therefore, is built on this note and is a D-flat dominant seventh chord. Another way to determine a tritone substitute dominant chord is to think of it as an approach chord whose root note is a semitone above the following one chord. Applying this to our 2-5-1 progression in C, our tritone substitute dominant is again a D-flat dominant seventh chord as the note D-flat is a semitone above C. As you can see, using a tritone substitute chord creates a semitone descent between the root notes of the supertonic and tonic chords of our 2-5-1 progression. The dominant seventh and its tritone substitute dominant have two notes in common. In our example, they're the notes B and F. These two shared notes are the tritone interval found between the leading note and subdominant in the key of C major the key from which our 251 example is taken. The interval between the leading note and subdominant of a major scale is a tritone. This interval forms part of the leading note diminished and half diminished seventh chords and the dominant seventh chord of the major scale. Tritones have a tendency to resolve inwards to a major or minor third interval. The B to F tritone from a C major scale, for example, typically resolves to the major third C to E, which is often part of a tonic or submediant chord. If the chord of resolution includes a seventh extension, the tritone's resolution can be modified to create the seventh of the chord of resolution. In our example, the B of the tritone can be held to create the B of the C major seventh chord and here creates a perfect fourth with the E resolution. As in a major scale, a tritone interval is also found between the leading note and subdominant of the harmonic minor and ascending melodic minor scales. In the scales of A harmonic and A melodic minor, for example, the tritone is found between the notes G sharp and D. As with the tritone in a major scale, in the minor scales, the G sharp to D tritone can be part of the leading note diminished triad, diminished seventh, and half diminished seventh chords, and the dominant seventh chord. You may have noticed that in the harmonic minor scale, there's another tritone between the supertonic and submediant. This tritone is also typically found in the leading note diminished seventh chord, and typically resolves to a major or minor third interval. Returning now to our tritone substitute chords. Because the G7 and D flat dominant 7th chord share the notes B and F, both chords have a tendency to resolve to the one chord containing the major 3rd C, E. 
This means that whether literally played by the rhythm section or implied by a soloist, the third and seventh of the substitute dominant behave the same as the third and seventh of the progression's actual dominant seventh chord and resolve to either a major third or a perfect fourth interval. If we look at the same 2-5-1 progression in the parallel key of C minor, we see that here also the notes of the tritone substitute chord behave the same as in a major key progression. As mentioned previously, a tritone substitution can be literally present in the tune's chord progression or can be implied by a soloist or members of a rhythm section. If a soloist, for example, was to imply a D-flat dominant 7th chord by arpeggiating its notes over a tune's G7 harmony, the flat 5 and flat 9th extensions would be introduced. The flat 5 and flat 9th extensions of our example are contained in the D-flat Lydian flat 7 mode, which is the Lydian flat 7 mode with the same root note as our substitute chord. The Lydian flat 7 mode is the fourth mode of the melodic minor scale and is often the mode of choice for soloing over tritone substitute chords. The melodic minor scale from which the Lydian flat 7 mode is taken also contains the superlocrian mode beginning on its 7th degree. The superlocrian mode is often the mode of choice for soloing over dominant 7th chords in 2-5-1 progressions. In our example, therefore, the D-flat Lydian flat 7 mode is the 4th mode of the A-flat melodic minor scale and can be used over the D-flat dominant 7th substitute chord. And the G superlocrian mode, the 7th mode of the A-flat melodic minor scale, can be used over the progression's G dominant 7th chord. Often the supertonic chord of the substitute dominant 7th chord is also either implied by a soloist or is present in a tune's progression. In our example, an A flat minor 7th chord can be used over or instead of the D minor 7th supertonic chord. Note just the root note of the A flat minor 7th chord is a tritone away from the D minor 7th root note. However, Although this tritone relationship exists between these chords, they share no notes in common, and the A flat minor 7th chord's existence is based on its supertonic relationship to the tritone substitute dominant chord. Interestingly, the Lydian flat 7 mode, the same mode used to solo over both the actual dominant and the substitute dominant of our progression, can also be used over the A flat minor 7th chord. Combining tritone supertonic 7th and dominant 7th substitutions with the actual chords of a 2-5-1 progression produces the following tritone substitute progressions. I hope you found this useful. Thanks for watching. See you next time.